whenever we think of the leading electronics brands that have dominated for decades. Apple Inc. is what comes to our minds. Not only is it one of the most appealing brands to consumers, but it is also the most competitive when it comes to innovation and technology. It all started with a business venture in the music and electronics industry with inventions such as the iPod Shuffle, iPod Mini, iTouch, MacBooks, and now the ever-evolving iPhone. To this day, citizens choose Apple products more than any other brand in the world. The integrity that Apple continues to provide has brought them millions of loyal, die-hard customers. But what if we told you that Apple is switching it up by venturing in the car industry? sounds unusual for a phone company to be attempting to diverge into a different lane. However, with today's technological advancement, anything is possible. This is Luxcope, and in this video, we will be taking a peek at Apple's first futuristic self-driving Apple car. Yup, you've heard it right. Are you curious about what this vehicle has to offer to the next generations? Well, strap on tight and enjoy the smooth ride. Before we jump right in, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell for more updates on our luxurious content. Now let's get into it. Hearsay about the Apple car has been going around for a couple of years, and it's finally starting to come together as more than just rumors. So how do you think a cell phone company will be able to transition into making car products as well? The key word is collaboration. And Apple CEO Tim Cook found people he can work with in creating this project. Watch out Tesla because the Apple car codenamed Titan is coming for you. With Apple's assets amounting to over $200 billion and a market cap of $1 trillion, it's definitely going to be a tough competition between the two leading tech companies. Putting its competition aside, Let's take a look at the potentially dominating Apple car. Here's everything you need to know about the futuristic vehicle that will most likely take over the world soon. Apple has reportedly been working on Project Titan since 2014, and keeping it secret was their first step in completing the project. Of course, they wouldn't want to give one of their greatest inventions away that easy. Especially with monstrous competition coming in from every direction, Apple is said to have a projected release date planned in 2024, but some experts say it won't be released until sometime between the years 2025 and 2027. Project Titan is spearheaded by Tesla's former engineer, Doug Field. Looking back at the crowd's reaction during the release of the iPhone, you can clearly see how excited people are to have this creation within their reach. To complete Project Titan, Apple will have to work with already established car manufacturers to keep it steady, and Korean company Hyundai appears to be their first choice. Apple is doing their best to court Hyundai into producing their newest product. Fabricating this kind of groundbreaking electric vehicle is not cheap, and assembling a single unit already costs a billion dollars. However, as of 2020, Apple already had over $191.83 billion in cash, enough to produce an up-to-date EV. Creating this masterpiece also requires a massive supply chain to have more than 10,000 components needed in the car. Engineer Steve Zadesky, who is now the company's vice president, is in charge of the design and machinery. Project Titan's astounding features will be high-quality battery technology maybe even beating Tesla's range and efficiency. Speaking of Tesla's EV, it takes 20 minutes for Tesla's electric cars to charge at 50%, and Apple might even be able to top that. How? By freeing up excess space in the battery packs. Removing pouches and modules that hold battery materials will apparently make charging more efficient. Sounds pretty simple. The Apple team wants Project Titan to have a range of 400 to 500 miles at minimum, and of course, you'd expect the Apple car to have a full integration of the iOS plus Siri to create the entire Apple experience. Siri's role with the electric vehicle is to be able to control everything with a single word prompt. Since most Apple users already know how to use Siri, passengers will be able to play music, navigate, and control its speed just by uttering the famous phrase, Hey Siri! Pretty cool, don't you think? Rumor is, Apple will be using a C1 chip based on the A12 Bionic processor and features high-quality AI capabilities like eye tracking. 
The eye tracking function will be able to know if the driver is out of sorts or feeling sleepy. This particular feature is already being explored by most of the car manufacturers, but as we know, Apple is looking to improve upon every concept that is already being thought of. External characteristics of the Apple Project Titan still remain a mystery to the public, but seeing how Apple creates such a sleek and minimalist design for their electronics, you shouldn't expect anything less from their electric vehicle. With their skillful architects, designers, and engineers, it's no doubt that it will be an eye candy, coming in various colors just like your phones. Since Apple products are basically considered as luxury items, it usually looks pretty. We could expect the Apple car to look sleek with its modern aerodynamic design. There are even speculations going around that Project Titan will be installed with high-resolution LED screens in the front and the back. These LED screens aren't used for navigation like the normal functioning ones, but it will be used as headlights and taillights. Now that's what I call innovation. Similar to Tesla's Model X, Project Titan is also expected to have gull wing doors. Now, you might be wondering how much Apple's first self-driving car would cost. With a brand's name and functionality, who will be able to afford such a luxury model? Piper Jeffrey analyst Gene Munster predicts that a single model of codenamed Titan would cost roughly $75,000, which is relatively cheaper than Tesla's $81,000 retail price of the Tesla Model X. With all the innovation, technology, and the iOS legendary features coming together to form a self-driving car, Apple is indeed one of Tesla's greatest competitors in the electric car industry. But how much competition would it actually create between the two monster companies? Well, we can't know for sure until both companies release their own models. It's up to the consumers which ones they like the most. However, according to statistics, Tesla currently has an 18% market share of electric vehicles and Apple can easily surpass that with the popularity of its products. Apple Industries currently hold 11.8% share of the smartphone market across the globe and over 40% in the United States. Looking into the future, if car enthusiasts pick the Apple car over Tesla's model, Tesla could easily lose billions of dollars. Here's a little fun fact about the ongoing competition between the two companies. Did you know that Tesla CEO Elon Musk tried to sell Tesla to Apple back in 2017? Even power companies like these have their darkest days, and during these times, Tesla reached out to Tim Cook for a meeting, offering him the company. However, the Apple CEO refused Elon's proposal. Tesla was reportedly struggling to get the vehicles produced at only $60 billion and thought it was a better idea to sell it to Apple instead. Today, Tesla has over $780 billion of total assets, proving Tim Cook's decision to be a huge mistake. Despite the circumstances, the straddle between the two companies will still be ongoing and we are left to sit back and watch as the companies fight for the comfort and extra safety of people. At the end of the day, both innovations are going to be very helpful to mankind and it's up to you to choose which models fit your style the best. So what do you think of Apple's newly proposed self-driving car? Do you think it's any better than Tesla's? If so, tell us why in the comments section below. This is Luxcove and thank you once again for tagging along this journey of futuristic inventions. Don't forget to leave us a like and hit that notification bell to be part of our growing community. We'll see you next time.